Hi, let's go on with our gothic gameplay. We were at the new camp. We bought, we got a uh, free armor, and we learned acrobatics and some fighting skills. Uh, we were here at the bar, talked to Bali Sidro. Now we want to uh, take that annoying quest of uh, giving water to the peasants. And we will find something interesting there. You think? Hey, just arrived. We need somebody to take some water to the peasants in the rice field. This way you can make friends with a few people. Sure. Great. Go Alright, so we go to the rice lord, he will give us twelve bottles of water. You take care of the Why? Lefty sent me. Oh yeah. I'm to bring the peasants some water. Right. Here's a dozen bottles of water. There's about twice that amount of peasants. So make sure you share it out even. Okay, so we just start talking to peasants and giving them Lefty. some water. I will skip the dialogues. Because it's quite annoying. Lefty said. Thanks, boy. We'll do this for other ten peasants. This one is a ratio. What are you doing here? You're looking for trouble? Here we have to answer. Relax. Hey, relax. I'm a newcomer. Huh? You look okay, though. You never know. You get new guys come along thinking they're it every day. Give some water. Thanks, man. What's a man like you doing with a peasant? Lee asked me that. I don't fight anymore, except to defend myself. I killed a guy once. And that was once too many. That's why they chucked me in this goddamn colony. It was justice. How did it happen? It was just an ordinary bar fight. I didn't mean to kill the guy. I just must have hit him too hard. I was a blacksmith at the time. I didn't know my own strength. Why did you join this camp? I'll tell you. My only option was to join those cyclunies, and I didn't want to let those gurus of theirs mess about with my brain. In the old camp, I'd have had too much trouble with the guards, but the mercenaries and rogues do have some respect. They're afraid of you? Maybe. Anyway, I found peace here, and you should try the same. Well, Can you teach me to be as strong as you are? Even if I could, what would you use your strength for? So I can wipe out. Hmm. You wouldn't be. I will defeat the Rice Lord and his thugs if you help me. Good. I've sworn I'll never attack anyone again. But I never said I wouldn't teach anyone else to do it. I'm all ears. If you want to hit powerfully, you need to know the right tactic. Learn to push your whole arm through. For the better. You Use your knowledge for a just cause. All right. So we got five free uh, strength. If you don't have the option to to tell him that you want to defeat the Rice Lord, you have to talk with the guy behind the bar. I mean, mean, there is a door. In the other video, we talk with him. So you talk to him, and he will tell you that there is a disoration that uh, wants to. Um, let's say he wants to fight the Rice Lord. So if you say him to him that answer that I said, he will give you that free strength. Thanks. I think we have seven peasants Thanks. left. 
me check. Six, okay. It just takes some time to give the water to everyone. This guy doesn't say much uh, useful thing, many useful things, so Hi. I just skip the dialogue. He was one of the first. Yeah, as you see, you can't obtain anything from him. is useless so it's I just skip the dialogues in that case you must know a lot of mm, so so why are you taxes boys? right as you see nothing useful hey you well done I think this is exactly the right task for you from now on you do it every day go on with it right now if you don't do it any uh, every day, like if you skip one day, the next time left is easier, he will beat you up. So you better avoid him until you are you are strong enough to beat him. I will say at least uh, 40 or 50 strength and master in uh, in one-handed swords. So you'll be sure to beat him. And when you beat him, don't worry, anyone, nobody, well, actually, um, you will get attacked by the Rice Lord. And I think also from the other rogues, but I'm not sure, I don't remember. But anyway, they are beatable. If you're a master in 100 world, with uh, 50 of strength. Okay, so now... Already talked with him. There is this one, okay. The lurker. Alright, I think that for the moment. Rely on somebody, and you're in trouble. That's how it goes. I think there is nothing else to do at the moment, so. We might just sleep until the morning. Just sleep here. Even if you get angry, it doesn't matter. Hey you! Alright. Lucky for you, but I would have enjoyed If you stay inside his house for too much time, he will attack you. But anyway. You can just run away if you want. Now I guess the best thing to level up. You are not uh, well. You are not forced to do the acrobatics. I mm, did uh, the acrobatics just for for fun for, to show you what it is about. But it's not really that useful. I mean, it can be useful if you want, but you don't need it to go on with the game. 
it's more it's just farming so we'll go to the old hey you oh, I God. told you that I don't run back to your mommy yeah just uh, run away and now I will go to the uh, old mine uh, the to the mine of the old camp I will give a lesson to lefty the next time uh, we can go from the right or from here also if we want and we can now that we have some more uh, fighting skills we can kill some beasts to get some experience we should be able to kill uh, to kill the blood flies very easily the book about the blood flies you can also take their sting let me take some food you have to remember to cook those pieces of meat let's kill the scavengers also and then we we'll go to the monorats over there I should be able to kill all of them. Now they will probably attack me or another. the uh, up arrow while uh, pressing uh, control key otherwise you can just swing left right I think there is nothing here okay okay let's go to the mine and we'll take the list from Ion and take it to Laras I give it to Laris just to take some experience points because mm, it's not a problem to give it to Laris. I mean, you don't lose the the quest from the old camp from the old, so why not? Okay. Yeah, if you can kill some beasts on the way, you get some easy experience points. I would not recommend to go for wolves or, or lizards for the moment because they are very hard to kill for now. I mean if you are new to the game at least. So if you encounter two wolves and you are new to the game it's better if you uh, just uh, go away. Okay so here let's see if we find the Templars. No. Maybe later. For what I know, you can do nothing here. There is nothing you can do. Let's save the game just to be sure. Alright, we are inside the mine. We 
we'll skip the things I don't need. So this one is a um, merchant, a trader. And there is a ladder anyway, somewhere, somewhere. So you don't have to jump down. This ladder here. So first thing will go here. There is, uh, I think, uh, it's the <coughs> his name is Aleph, if I remember correctly. Yes, here. Yeah, Aleph. What do you mean? I only work when the guards are nearby. Or they can see me. Otherwise, I just hang around here. Don't they get suspicious? Yeah, well, of course I dig less ore than all the others do. It's not always enough, so I have to do a bit of trading. I keep my ears open. Okay, so all right, you're seeing ore. The Thanks. Ore. If you go to the main shaft and follow the catwalks further down, you'll soon get to two side caves. There's a guard in the second one, and there's also an old masher. There's a healing potion lying about somewhere. There is a guard be careful looking at us. And beware of the, the crawlers. Hell are you doing? You and if you need or hear something, come back to me. Alright. Sure. I expect Let's there's in. loads of locked chests here. Good luck. All right, well. So now we will go back. There is nothing else to do here. And we will see later that we can buy a key for a chest and we will give him 50 ore. So he will also give us a ring. I have a deal to suggest. If you make Aaron leave the chest alone, I'll give you ten or I'll see you yeah. We talk to Aaron and we lure him away. Ian said you, to you should go to see him at once. What does he want? To see him. And no idea. No idea. Then I'll go to see. Then we talk to the knives again. You owe me ten. Yeah, you've already earned it. Oh, and one more thing. I we buy the Give key. Give me the key. Do you make good bit? I just wonder what you get out of. I'm always glad when I can get one over on the gods. I'll see no. you. Yeah. Let's wait. Let's wait for him to be enough okay otherwise he will uh, notice oh where is the chest wait here yes all right now we'll go to the next one which is old bird i think What's in this? That's none of your business. Step you vet man. Here you go. Have one on me. Thanks. Now we will lure him away to anything special in the some chest that we store supplies in. Disappeared. I bet Aleph was involved. 
Yeah. Listen. What? Without me? Let me pass. We will go back to Olaf and uh, buy the key. And then we'll go to talk to Ian. Do you know anything about the key for the chest in the storage shed? Well, that depends. On how much ore I'll give you? You learn fast. 50 ore should be Maybe more than enough. Ore? Very generous. Here's the key. And take this ring as well. It's always brought good luck to me. Good luck. Well. Alright, so we have a ring. Some more stuff. We have both the rings now. I think there is a limit of two rings and one necklace that you can wear at the same time. And we have the key. So we're going to open the chest. Then after opening the chest we'll go to Ian and Aaron and Ulbert will talk to us but it's okay they will be a bit angry. Pay attention not to fall from here because if you go you fall down the wrong side you will surely die. Now we'll open the chests. Alright, as you can see the chests were worth it. Now you don't want to go to Ian before opening the chests if you have lured the guys away because they will get um, they will go back. Hey you! If you try to make a fool out of me again, you've had it! You got that? Hey, yeah, don't you miss the key to your key. chat? Indeed. I don't even want to guess how or why you know about the key. But I'll give you 20 ore if you get it back for me. Here's your key. Yeah, that's it. Well, here's your 20 ore, like, but you'd better watch out in future. From now on, I'll be keeping an eye on you. All right. No, hey you, concept. there was no grilled meat at all! Oh, um, I guess I must have been mistaken. Have a good day. This is another trader if you want. Can I? Yep. Then we we'll talk to Ian. Are you yeah, I'm Ian. And this is my mind. So don't touch or break anything. Alright. Diego sent me. I'm to collect the list. All right, here's the list. Tell him to hurry up with the deliveries. I'll just have a look. Don't make it. Okay, so we're done here. If you want, you can go down at the uh, bottom of the mine. There is uh, a blacksmith, not a blacksmith. Um, well, uh, a worker. I don't remember his name. And. Um, he can, uh, he, you can trade with him, and he has like uh, 750 or pieces. So if you need ore, you can go to him and sell some stuff. But there is nothing else we can do here now, so I won't go down because I will need a lot of time to go down and then go back. We will just leave the mine. We'll give the list to Laras. 
we had a redeeming view from more drug. No, we are not at the next level yet, but we will get there very soon. Now there is a guy here that sells lockpicks, if I remember correctly. What should I keep in mind when I'm in the mine? Beware of the mine crawlers. The further you get down, you can hit the... I heard I could buy lockpicks. Well, since you were brainy enough to find that out, you can have some... If you want to buy some lockpicks, but... We have five, we are, we are, we are good for the moment. Alright, so let's save the game. And let's go on. Let's see if the Templars are here. Mm, maybe it's too soon. But we will find them. Looking to one of the Templars here will give us uh, the possibility to learn how to uh, get the, the money balls from the Minecrawlers for free. It will be useful later. I think Korkalom also teaches uh, that to us, but yeah, well, you can just learn it anyway. Now, so we will uh, be better with some more strength, but let's try to kill some goblins to get some more experience points. Hmm, three goblins, not that easy. Just to be sure, let's take them. All right. One down. Good. Last one. Okay, and those things are lurkers and you don't want to find them now. They are too strong. Now let's go to uh, Laras. Let's try to avoid Lefty because I don't want to beat him now. I might do that, I mean I might be able to do that, but I prefer to wait a little bit, I don't want to take 10 minutes to win a fight, so I will just try to avoid him. I don't know if he will attack me when he sees me. I mean without a warning, but I'll just run away anyway. Alright, so I will need the ring from Mordrag, but I will give it to Laris now. So we can level up. You can do this later if you want. So you can use the ring for a um, for more time. I'm so close to the next level. When I reach 20 points, I will. I will go to. Um, Where do you want? We see Mordrak sent me. I will go to Ord. And this is fine. We can go in. Um, watch out not to take 
anything instead of talking to him because it happens to me sometimes and he will get uh, mad and uh, kill you or try to kill you okay, so here you can improve your strength and dexterity if you want I want oh Okay, level up and give him the list. I no. Indeed. What Bal Isidro from the sect camp has weed worth at least four hundred. Yeah, there is also Looks this. Like you. If you have the weed, sack, then we'll talk again. Give him the four hundred. I have the four hundred. Good. So we get the experience now <clears throat> if i ask him if this is enough you again i wouldn't like to be in i will and he will accept, accept me in the whole new camp and i don't People want that now okay so we have some more experience now uh, i don't have anything to do here Didn't I give him the? Or maybe it was a dex. Yeah, it was a dexterity ring. Okay, so it's it's very fine. Not a problem. I would like to be here when I have twenty skill points. I can learn the one-handed skill at master level, but it's okay. I will do that later. Now. We will go back to the old camp. Old. I forgot about left him. Now to go back to the old camp, I will take this way. So I can kill some beasts. Yeah, if I didn't learn acrobatics, I would be master in one-handed words. So you can do that instead of acrobatics, but it's fine anyway. It's not that important. Now I will go this way. If you go uh, inside... This waterfall on the right, there is a cavern, but usually there is also a lurker there, so I won't go there right now. Maybe next time. Okay, too many. Go back for a moment. Save the game. I'll try to take them. Not all together, otherwise they will kill me. Okay, two are fine. Okay, critical hit. Blood flies can be quite annoying. Alright, so let's go on. Don't go too much inside the forest or you will find Wolves, they are not really friendly. Stay on this side like I'm doing. And you will be fine. Okay.
Was close. Right now, let's go to the other side. like with the first blood fly that she went around me you uh, leave the control key and then press again when you're on the target or you leave the arrow and keep control key pressed you should be uh, you should be able to kill it Okay, so right, right, left, right, okay. Left, left, right, right, left, okay. Drive from here. If I don't get stuck somewhere. Alright. Okay, perfect. to the next level so if you want you can learn the one-handed um, one-handed skill in the old camp too if you don't want if you don't want to go back to the new camp or just make sure to have 20 points at the new camp so you can spend them I mean 30 in total 10 for the first level and 20 for the second level Don't go that way because you will be dead in a moment or now. Alright, so now we will go to uh, give the list to Diego. Complete the quest with Taurus. And then I think we will go to the sect camp with uh, with uh, the ball that will, will accompany us.
Uh, there should be, yeah, some scavengers here. There is a lizard also, I don't know if I can kill it. Oh, okay. They already killed it. These are the Templars I was talking about before. I would have preferred to kill the lizard to get the points, but okay. Let me pass. Cornered rock. Hi, where are you off to? We take the mine crawler secretion from our brothers in the old mine to Korkala. We go to the old mine every day to collect it. What kind of secretion is it? We obtain it from the mandibles of the mine crawlers. If you know how to do it, you can take them out without losing the secretion. Can you tell me how to get the secretion of a mine crawler? Of course. As far as I know, he makes a potion with it which increases the magic powers of a novice since with Have you no All right, so now we learn that thing too. Uh, there is a chest here. I think that if you want just for fun, I think you can do this or no? No? Okay, I thought you could light it up. Maybe it's on Gothic 2 or on another. Another fire. No, I could kill those two, so oh, I should be able to hmm, almost go to the next level. Ooh. Yeah, 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 yeah. We will go to the next level here. You don't want to go that way. Because you will find the orc dogs, the wargs, that will kill you very easily. Now let's kill the last ones. Then I think that I will just improve my strength. With 10 points. Because by the time I reach the new camp again. I'll be, I'll have 20 points again, so. Or I could just go back to the new camp, but it will be annoying to go now, so I will go next time. sneak around if you want so you will be able to go inside houses easily easy or mm -hmm, more easily but I prefer lock picks anyway all right Have the list from Ian. Well done. Take care. Right as, as you see, he said nothing, but in our journal. It says that he might have noticed the, the that we gave it to Lars. Let's talk to Taurus. 
He's never going to show his face around here again. I'd have felt happier if you'd killed him. Alright. Let's cook some meat now. Since we're here, you can just keep pressing the upper row key fast. So you will do it uh, faster. Okay, we are done. And we have a hundred of pieces. I don't know if we had all that raw meat. Maybe it's still bugged because there is a bug when you go too fast. It will make more pieces than you actually have. So I don't know if it was bugged or if we really had that hundred pieces of raw meat. Let's see if we can sell some. Show me your good. Okay, well, I'll give him these ones, these ones. I can sell some stuff. Very good. I'll go ahead. Follow me. Okay, this is like with more drug. Let's save the game. we should be able to get to 20 by the time we are back well the second camp will be will require us to spend some time there because there are some long quests to do long I mean just go around a lot Very 
very good. Now that one right there. Uh, no, those are walls. Okay, I thought it was a shadow beast. There is a shadow beast in that forest, so don't go there for now. Because the shadow beast is very strong. You will need at least in this moment, I think, Master of One and the Sword and 70 to 90 strength and a better sword to kill a shadow beast easily. Yeah, 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 go to the lizards, so we kill some lizards and get the experience. Those lizards are quite annoying to kill, but they are not so easy. So pay attention, they are very quick. Hmm, scavengers, let me kill them for some free experience. Oh god, there are wolves also. Goodbye! Ah, is that... yeah, I think... Yes, that one... Is the Shadow Beast. Hmm, very useful the first person. But there is a Shadow Beast there. If you press R, R you can look back if you want. Might be useful sometimes to see if someone is following you, like Dusty or someone else. Alright. Uh, there is something here. Oh, if, no, the next. The next rock, there is something to collect. Like, I think, beans or something like that. It will be... Um, no, where is it? Or am I mistaking? Okay, alright, I don't remember. Oh gosh. Oh, here they are, the beans. Beach seed, okay. Some more scavengers here. Alright. Let's see the scavengers now. Oh, I don't have it, so. Thank you for coming here and giving me some points. Alright. Alright, we are close to the next level. I think we'll just go to the new camp the next time and... and learn the next level of 100 words. Now we'll go inside the sect camp, do some stuff and then I will go on the next time. Here we are. Go through the gate and speak to my brothers. I right. If you want, the Templars will sell you a, an armor here, but it's um, not that. Greetings, good, stranger. So. You're treading on holy ground. This is the Brotherhood of the Sleeper. What brings you here? I've heard you're looking for new people. I want to join you. Then, be welcome. I, I need better than. Okay, this one, but yeah. It's the novice armor, but it's not very good. Alright. So, this is Lester. He will take you around at the camp. You? You're lucky that you didn't talk to Bal Namib. No stranger is allowed to talk to the guru. Yeah, don't waste your time talking to the gurus for the moment. But I want to talk to your master. Okay. 
Okay, now we will do the first. How can I find my way around? I can show you the most important places. Show me the... To the alchemy lab, okay. To the alchemy lab. Follow me! We will do the first guru now. So he will take you to the alchemy lab. Now he is uh, away from his master, so... Yeah, let's How can I say get your this. master to talk to me? You have to know what he wants to hear. And that is? Listen, when we're with him the next time, you'll address me and we'll have a little talk. Bal Namib is worried because many of the novices don't only pray to the sleeper, but also to their former god. You'll tell me that you've renounced the old gods and that in future, you'll pray only to the sleeper. Then I'll ask you why you made this decision. And you'll say that you had a vision in which the sleeper summoned you. He'll be interested then. Do you think you'll manage that? No problem. All right, so I'll change my mind. I changed my mind. Suppose you know where to... F okay, so he goes back, we don't need him. If you need him, you can go with him if you want. Now, this is Melvin. Hi, you aren't from this camp, are you? Well, now, I am. I left the old camp a week ago. Told my pal Dusty to come along, but he wanted to wait. I know Dusty. I talked to him for a short time. If you meet him again, tell him that he was dumb to stay there. It's ten times better than getting harassed by the guards in the old camp. I'll tell him if I see him again. All right, so. Next time we meet Balnamib, we will be able to convince him to let us in this act camp. This is Balkadar. We will have to convince him later. Now let's go to Baltondra here. He will give us a quest to find a new member for the... You don't look like one who submitted to slavery. To this act camp. Hey, you spoke... I see you've become... All right. How can I... Most of all, we need new souls to join our community by recruiting one more man to our camp. You will prove that you're willing to do good service to our community. Work. Why are you so desperate for new members? The sleeper has spoken to our master, revealing that he has an important message for us. However, he has not gathered full strength yet. That's why he needs our strength to contact us. Therefore, we are preparing a great invocation. And the more men participate, the likelier we are to be successful. If you want to know more about it, go to the large court in front of the Temple Hill. But don't disturb our master in his meditations. Okay, so... This is the quest. like to get to know the camp then you've come to the wrong place <laughs> good right that 
We can make some swords if we want to. No, this is for Cologne. And down there, there is Fortuno. Come closer. Every newcomer to this place receives a gift of welcome. What have you got from it? Here, take three rolls of swamp weed. It's northern dark. Good stuff. You can have more of it every day. But if you want more than your daily ration, well, you need to pay. If you find berries and herbs on the paths between the camps, you can bring them to me. I'll buy them off you. Yeah, he will trade, but nothing special. Now I will just show you this place. This is where they play for the sleeper. And we can give him the dream Here, camp. Master, a modest present from your student. From the new camp. Go to sleep. Now we we'll just have to wait a moment. In the name of the sleeper, I've had a vision. It was incredible. I saw that we would win a new brother. One who was not like those who came before him. He was doing something to us. There was a sword in his hand, and he was descending a wide flight of stairs. Then the vision ended. He looked very much like you. Who are you? What do you want? I'm just a modest servant of the sleeper. Go to Kor Kalom. He'll take care of you. Okay. It's good to see you again. How have you been doing? I have renounced the old gods. Really? What made you do that? I had a vision. The sleeper talked to me. What did he say? He said, go to the camp in the swamp and join the Brotherhood. You're a very rich man, stranger. 
The sleeper doesn't reward many people like that. The sleeper has chosen you. Do you really want to join us? Well... Okay. Yes, I wish to follow the sleeper. Go to Kor Kalom. Tell him I sent you because you are a true supporter of the faith. Get out of the oh, way! Right. So we already completed the true... gurus. Next time we'll go with the other ones. Uh, one is right here and one is Barkadar. Okay, so we have 20 experience points. We could go to the new camp next time and become master in the one-handed sword. But we will do that next time, guys. Thank you for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Let me know. And see you next time very soon with a new video. Thank you and bye bye.